Today I have a very interesting story for you. It's called Prahala, the Iki Poised King. Now, what does Iki Poised mean? First, let's listen to the story. Once, Virochan, King Prahala's son, was playing with Sudamba, the king's guru's son. When they were playing, the, they made up a question, who is more superior? Virochan said, I am more superior because I am the king's son and the king is in the highest position. Sudanva said, that may be true, but I am the king's guru's son and the guru is naturally more superior than the student, so I am more su superior. Then they settled on the matter. Alright, let's tell the king about our matter. But then Virochan said, But if we let my father decide, then if he picks me, you will say that it is unfair. Then Sudanva said, No, your father always picks the right choice. I am sure he will not do it for his pleasure. So they went to the king and told him the situation. They said, that whoever is more superior will stay alive and who is not will die. And the king said, Sudanga, you are my guru's son, so you are naturally more superior. Virochan was taken aback. The king said, Guards, take Virochan away. Sudanva was watching the guards taking Virochan away and then told the king, Okay, I have another question. Who between you and me is more superior? And the king said, You are my guru's son, so you will naturally be more superior than me. Then Sudanva said, If I am more superior to you, will you obey me? And the king said, Yes, of course I will. And Sudanva said, Alright then, I, I order you to let Virochan free. And the king told the guards, Guards, let Virochan free. So, King Prahalad, he was not sad that his son had to die and he was neither excited that his son would stay alive. In these situations, he was the same calm Prahalad. So, in Bhagavad Gita, verse 12.18 and 19, Sri Krishna says, Those who treat enemy and friend Joy and sorrow, heat and cold, all the same and keep their minds attached only to me are very dear to me. In the story we just heard, Prahala was per perfectly equipoised because of his devotion. If we also perfect our devotion, we will also be stable in every situation. To enrich your knowledge with more such enlightening stories, read Bhagavad Gita commentary by Swami Mukuntananda. Radhi Radhi.